Good morning, everybody. Kurt Risch here, and thanks for joining me on One Shepherd. So today we are continuing with our Old Testament reading of the book of Numbers, chapter 34. Then the Lord spoke to Moses, saying, Command the children of Israel, and say to them, When you come into the land of Canaan, this is the land that shall fall to you as an inheritance, the land of Canaan to its boundaries. Your southern border shall be from the wilderness of Zin along the border of Edom, Then your southern border shall extend eastward to the end of the Salt Sea. Your border shall turn from the southern side of the ascent of Akrabim, continue to Zin, and be on the south of Kadesh, Barnea. Then it shall go on to Hazar, Adder, and continue to Asmon. The border shall turn from Asmon to the brook of Egypt, and it shall end at the sea. As for the western border, you shall have the great sea for a border. This shall be your western border. And this shall be your northern border. From the great sea you shall mark out your border line to Mount Hor. From Mount Hor you shall mark out your border to the entrance of Hamath. Then the direction of the border shall be toward Zedad. The border shall proceed to Ziphon, and it shall end at Hazar, Enon. This shall be your northern border. You shall mark out your eastern border from Hazar, Enon to Shephem. The border shall go down from Shephan to Riblah, on the east side of Ain. The border shall go down and reach the eastern side of the Sea of Chinnereth. The border shall go down along the Jordan, and it shall end at the Salt Sea. This shall be your land with its surrounding boundaries. Then Moses commanded the children of Israel, saying, This is the land which you shall inherit by lot, which the Lord has commanded to give to nine tribes and to the half-tribe. For the tribe of the children of Reuben, according to the house of their fathers, and the tribe of the children of Gad, according to the house of their fathers, have received their inheritance, and the half-tribe of Manasseh has received its inheritance. The two tribes and the half-tribe have received their inheritance on this side of the Jordan, across from Jericho, eastward toward the sunrise. And the Lord spoke to Moses, saying, These are the names of the men who shall divide the land among you as an inheritance, Eleazar the priest, and Joshua the son of Nun. And you shall take one leader of every tribe to divide the land for the inheritance. These are the names of the men from the tribe of Judah, Caleb the son of Jephunneh, from the tribe of the children of Simeon, Shemuel the son of Amihud, from the tribe of Benjamin, Eliadad the son of Chilson, a leader from the tribe of the children of Dan, Buki the son of Jogli, from the sons of Joseph, a leader from the tribe of the children of Manasseh, Haniel, son of Ephod, and leader from the tribe of the children of Ephraim, Kemuel, the son of Shiptan, a leader from the tribe of the children of Zebulun, Elizaphan, the son of Parnach, a leader from the tribe of the children of Issachar, Paltiel, the son of Azan, a leader from the tribe of the children of Asher, Ihud, the son of Shalomi, a leader from the tribe of the children of Naphtali, and Pedalal, the son of Amahud. These are the ones the Lord commanded to divide the inheritance among the children of Israel in the land of Canaan. And guys, that's it for our Old Testament reading of Numbers chapter 34. Thanks for joining us. Be sure to like and subscribe below. If you have any comments or questions, by all means, put that below. I'd love to chat with you, and may you have a great day, and God bless.